Hi, boys and girls. Well, today we're going to read a story, a book about the most common liquid on the planet, which is water. And the title of our book is called Water as a Liquid. I see two sight words on here, as and a. Water as a liquid. So now you know why it's so important to learn those sight words, because they're everywhere. So really take your time to look at those sight words and find out what they are, because they're in many, many different books, both nonfiction and fiction. Water as a liquid. Which one, which liquid do you see on our cover here? Yes, the ocean and a wave, you're right. It's curling over, getting ready to crash onto the shore, perhaps. And it is by Helen Frost. Hmm. Let's find out about water as a liquid. This is a very little book. Some books can be very big. Here is our title page, Water as a Liquid by Helen Frost. And Table of Contents. So here is the subject material, and here is the page I would find it on. Water can be a solid, a gas, or a liquid. Water is a liquid when it is not too cold or too warm. Can you see some sight words on this page? Do you think you could read this page? I think you could. Practice, practice. Water as a liquid does not have a shape. It is the shape of whatever holds it. Hmm, so I can see on this picture, a person is pouring water from one glass to another glass. Hope he doesn't spill it. Clouds are dust and tiny drops of water. Sometimes the water falls to the ground as rain. Good job. Yes, here's our rain. And we can see the rain coming down here. Some water goes into the ground. People pump groundwater from wells. So we can see this boy is pumping the handle up and down. And then this boy is collecting the water. Oh, nope, that's a girl. Sorry. Yeah, it looks like she's uh, washing her hands maybe. And I'm glad they've got a container to catch the old water. And then that way they could maybe use it to water the garden so it's not wasting. Some water fills lakes and rivers. Hmm. So I had lakes and rivers. I like swimming in lakes. And a lake is a mass of water that is surrounded by land. Water flows from high places to low places. Rivers carry water to oceans. So a river is a byway or a form of almost transportation that can get water from one place to another. So maybe from a mountain flowing down a mountain, then through a valley, and then out into the ocean. Most water on earth is in oceans. Water in oceans is salt water. Salt water is not safe for people to drink. Ugh. I don't think it tastes very good anyway. But sometimes when I have a sore throat, they have us gargle salt water to help it feel better. Hmm, interesting. Water in most rivers and lakes is fresh water. Fresh water is safe for people to drink. Oh, and I see a compound word. Fresh water, fresh water. Water is part of all living things, people, 
plants and animals need water to live. Sure do. And then here is some more information. Words that we needed to know from our book, more suggestions for reading, and some internet sites that you can go to to learn about water as a liquid. Well, today you're going to take some, hmm, let's see, one form of water and turn it into another form of water. So scroll on down and see how you're going to change the matter, change the state of water from one state of matter to another state of matter.